Okay, Zer is at Watcher's Grave in Nessus, and let's see what he has. Come on, that's some good stuff. All right, he's got hard light. That's a good, uh, a good auto rifle, especially if you want to go into like a nightfall or some other activity, and you want to match all the burns. You can change the burn, you know, live while you're in the game. So that's a good one. Uh, Liar's Handshake, awesome exotic for hunters, especially this season. It's an okay roll, uh, but again, if you don't have these, these allow you to do increasingly aggressive melee damage um, against enemies. Uh, cheaty Boots, I'm sorry, Lion Ramparts. Um, a good average roll, not bad. Um, if you're doing jumping puzzles, this would be really great for your Titan. And then Crown of Tempest. So this is a really great um, exotic to have as part of arc builds. So if you don't have it, definitely give this. It's it's not a bad roll here. Uh, you know, good recovery. Uh, let's see if there's any good weapons. Not a big fan. Not a big fan. That's not bad, especially in certain builds. I happen to have really like the submachine gun. Not a big fan of that. Um, nothing there. Um, this could be good. It uh, just depends on what you know what content's going on in specific season. I've never been a fan of Star Shadows, so not really great there. But anyway, those are the weapons and armor for this week. Um, not bad rolls on some of these. Definitely check it out if you get an opportunity. Talk to you guys later.